And uh, you know, yes, we gain an hour of sleep, but we also lose possibly a day of an hour of sunlight. So mm. as we take a live look outside through a Cowster's camera, the sun will be setting tonight at 6 o'clock. Tomorrow, though, it's going to go down at 4.59. So a little bit of a give and take here. But overall, a pretty nice live look outside. Right now, temperature is here in the valley. We got 60, 62 for Sacramento, 61 in Stockton, 63 in Modesto. Right now, as we take a look at uh, Marysville, 59, 39 for South Lake Tahoe. And as we take a look at our humidity, 62%, our dew point at 49, and our winds right now coming down at, uh, from the north at 3 miles per hour, and our pressure is at 30.09. All right, taking a quick check of some of our daytime highs for much of our day today. Again, because of the cloud coverage, we didn't see a whole lot of temperatures getting into the low 70s. That's where we should be this time of the year, but we topped out at 59 in Marysville, 63 here in Sacramento, with mid 60s down towards Stockton and Modesto, and we did see low to upper 50s in the foothills. Pretty much sucked in this, uh, this Saturday for Truckee, so their daytime high getting into the upper 40s, low 50s out towards South Lake Tahoe. Now, looking ahead, we're going to be tracking the chance for more lingering light snow showers for the Sierra tonight. But tomorrow, expect to see mostly sunny skies with dry weather. Enjoy that, though, because by late Monday into Tuesday, we're tracking some widespread rain, gusty winds, possibly up to 35 miles per hour here in the valley. Sierra snow, that will be picking up again all late Monday into Tuesday. A look at our current satellite and radar right now. We're still going to track some unsettled weather for tonight and a few clouds hovering from the south southwest overnight here in the valley as we take a look though at a wider view of our storm track again sunshine for tomorrow and then by late monday to tuesday that's going to be the next storm system rolling in and we could pick up a good amount of rain here in parts of the valley and again those winds will be trending mainly from the south and southwest we're going to see those gusts again up to 30 to 35 miles per hour and you can see the front edge of that storm pushing in by late monday afternoon but it won't be i think in closer to midnight that we start to see some of the heaviest rain pushing through so monday we're still looking good if you have any outdoor plans or you still need to get outside and clean the gutters. Here's a look at some of the rainfall totals we're expecting into early next week. Again, possibly a little over about a half an inch here in the valley. Maybe a little more rain, though, expected down towards Stockton and even in Modesto, with possibly about an inch of rain expected up into Grass Valley. Snow levels right now still a bit tricky. This storm is a bit wetter, so we're not tracking a whole lot of snow, but you'll definitely get some up in the higher elevations. Tomorrow, uh, north winds will be coming in and cooling things off. And then as we head towards Monday afternoon, we'll start to see the winds shift a bit from the south. And again, it is going to be a bit gusty. Into early next week. Tonight, enjoy temperatures cooling off into the low 40s here in Sacramento. We'll see low 40s as well all across the foothills. Up in the high country, yeah, temperatures in the upper 20s to 30s. Tomorrow, though, as the winds trend in from the north, overnight lows on Sunday will be down into the upper 30s. So get ready to bundle up. Tomorrow, though, with the sunshine and that north wind, we're still looking at temperatures below average in the low 60s all across the valley floor. Up into the high country tomorrow, sunshine, but southeast winds, temperatures in the upper 40s for Truckee and South Lake Tahoe with low 50s out towards Plumas County. Down into the foothills, a beautiful Sunday as expected. We'll be seeing temperatures ranging from the low to upper 50s, even a few low 60s for Auburn and down towards San Andreas. And along the coast, just as nice tomorrow with 62 for San Francisco, 59 in Napa. And we'll see sunshine and 62 out in Fairfield. So seven-day forecast again. Enjoy tomorrow's beautiful weather. By Monday afternoon, we'll start to see a few changes with the winds increasing. But it's going to be Tuesday that we see the unsettled weather all across the board. And then the good news: Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday things dry up, and we start to warm up as well. Temperature is up in the foothills by next weekend, closer to 70 degrees. And then here in the valley, again, change the clocks tonight and let it fall back one hour. Monday we'll see temperatures a bit cooler, though upper 50s to start the week. Again, the rain moves in overnight Monday. It's going to be with us all day on Tuesday. We clear out, dry out. It's going to be a great Veterans Day on Thursday. And then take a look at your Friday and Saturday temperatures here in the valley. We're still a little bit below average, but we'll be pushing closer to 70 degrees. Steve? All right, that's a busy seven day forecast mm -hmm. ahead. Thanks, Jordan.